with me again, and today we're going to be doing a Wales vs England. This is Shane. Hello. He's my Welsh buddy. And basically, you're going to say some words in Welsh. Yep. And I'm going to guess what they are in England. English. English. And we're going to see who wins. But I suck at languages, so this is going to be fun. Let me look. Okay, so we're going to start with some easy ones. I say easy, but they're not going to be easy. Right, let's start with a really easy one. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Yay. Okay. Panic or dare. Oh, oh, that was not our lecture. Is that please? No. That was not our lecture. Mm -hmm. Yes. I can't remember. No. Cup of tea. Cup of tea. Right. Uh, door. Is, is that just a door or is, that, is it mean something different? It means something different. I don't know. And these are meant to be easy ones. Mm. No. I don't know. Water. Water. Juice. Is that juice? No, that's door. Oh. So confusing. Um Winad. Um I wanna say window. No, I don't know. How oh, an easy one. <laughs> they weren't easy. Right. Carry on then. Oh. Right. Sir. Um. Mm, mm, sir. Is it going to be like really obvious? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Say? No, star. Star. Yeah. Okay. Um. Teledi. Teledi. Uh. Is it, is it like a drink? No. <laughs> think about. Let's think about it in English. Right. Just take the first part and think. Is it telly? Yeah. Television. Yes. Yay! I got another one right. <laughs> um. Cribbles. Cupboard? Yes. Get in there. Cadar. Cadar. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. No. Chair. Chair. Gwelly? Gwen. That's like Gwen from Talk to <laughs> Gwelly. I don't know. No. I don't know. Bed. Bed. Ah, because I sat on my bed, you see. Third and final language one. Right. Alright, let's, let's try something really difficult. Ah. What? Ah. Ah. I have no idea. I've not heard that. Okay, it's an animal. It's, it's an a, animal? Yeah, it's a sweet animal. Cat? No. Dog? No. Bird? No. Animal. Um, is it like an obvious animal? Yeah. Hamster. No. Uh, guinea pig. No. Maybe it's like not actually a pet animal. So I think of animals in general. Lion. No. It's ferocious like a lion. Tiger. You usually like cuddly. Cuddly. Bear. Yes. Is it like my bears? Yes. Is it because I've got so many on my bed? Yes. Shall I show them? <laughs> Go on. This. Hang on. These are all my bears. I've got a few. Okay, right. Should we do one more? Yeah. Right, state I'm off theme. Soynog. What the fudge is that? Just guess. Soynodge. Soynog. Soynog. Oh, so I said it wrong. Um. I don't know. 
What should we have it earlier? Oh, fox! Yes. What does the fox say? <laughs> yeah, I think we're done with language. Yeah. I'm not doing very well. Okay, so after my fail <laughs> of the Welsh language, we're going to sort of look at Welsh stereotypes, I guess. Yeah. And you know nothing about rugby, so I can't debate you no, not about rugby. rugby. No. I hate sports in general. So I'll do that with one of my other Welsh friends. Yeah. You don't win on that one, sorry. No, no. Um, right. Welsh stereotypes and English stereotypes. Yeah. Do you want to start? Do Welsh people say is it at the end of everything? Some do, some don't. It's just like a general thing, I guess. A general thing, right, yeah. okay. Debatable. Right, English stereotype. Do English people drink tea? I drink tea. I don't like coffee. But we don't all stick our little pinky out. That's posh, I say. Yeah, and we don't all speak like the English. Oh, the I say. We don't all speak, one must do this, and no. Mm. I don't sound like that at all. <laughs> um, Welsh, Welsh, Welsh. I can't do a Welsh accent. Is Wales full of sheep? Because there's none in Abba. Uh, yes, actually, in town where I live, there's loads of sheep there, and also in like loads of fields. So if I'm on a train, anywhere in Wales, you always couldn't possibly see sheep. Okay, fact: there's loads of sheep in Wales, just like New Zealand. Okay, another English one. Um, do all gentlemen wear suits? If only, because <laughs> it'd be so much better than you know, chavs wearing their trousers halfway down their bums. Unfortunately, not. It's so, you know. Right, should we do one more? Because yeah. this is getting quite long now. Yes, it is. Welsh, Welsh, Welsh. Yeah, well, we've already kind of covered it, but is rugby more popular than football? Uh, in Wales, yes. I say it is, because of course rugby is the national sport of Wales. National sport of Wales, there we go. Right, okay, final one. Right. Um, do all women carry parcels? Like old fashioned people. No. I do have an umbrella with me, like, all the time though. Because I just had to be prepared. But no, we don't have parasols, unfortunately. Okay, so that's it for this week's video, guys. Thanks very much to Shane. You're welcome. No problem. He has a Twitter. Do you want me to put it in the description? Yeah, put it in the description. Put it in the description. I'll put his stuff in the description. Um, please give this a thumbs up. If you liked it, and if there's any other Welsh v England things you can leave them, then maybe I'll do a part two. Follow me on Twitter and Tumblr and other. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye! Bye!